This next trailer is something that I noticed at the tail end of the Star Wars trailer and it caught my eye because um, looked kind of interesting, the title. And so I go back to look for it and then I realized I already had it in my list to watch. So I'm going to check this out now because it's uh, pretty short and I would like to get a quick um, trailer in before I get back to work. So let's check this out. Sorry, it's called Silent Panic, and it's a thriller. I think I slept a total of 25 minutes last night. I know, me too. Hey, Dom, is there a room in the back? This is not going to fit. Oh. Someone came out in the middle of nowhere to dump a body. They see our car, they throw it in our trunk. Look, I'm not comfortable calling the cops, and I think we all know why. I don't want to touch it. I don't want to get my hair or fingerprints on it. I don't want to leave it here. I think we should go to the police. I don't, I don't want to feel comfortable with this. What are you gonna do? No. What a yeah. conundrum. Watch some TV. Chill out. Pretend that what's going on out there isn't happening. You're gonna bury me. have I seen her? I can't do that. We have to call the police. Do you realize every hour that goes by there's less and less of an option? I couldn't have enjoyed last night with my son. If we show up without him, he looks 100% guilty. <laughs> She's drunk. <laughs> Where are you going? Who are you? Oh my right goodness. Now? I don't even know what you're talking about. I just want to make sure that the murderer is found. No, you don't. Oh, it just is coming soon. Well, that was pretty interesting, actually. I would like to watch that because I'm curious to find out how things end up for them. When I'm watching it, as as it progressed, I kept thinking, oh, they're making all these terrible decisions. You know, it's like, just call the cops right away. Just call the cops. Because they're just digging themselves into a worse hole is what they're doing. But, of course, as I've mentioned before... If they don't make all these stupid decisions, then there would be no movie to watch. There would be no conflict to observe. And conflict is the whole point of a story. That's what moves things. There's always conflict in a story. No matter how small or whatever sort of innocuous form it takes, it's always some type of conflict because that's the whole purpose for the story. So, I mean, pretty much that's what it is in all stories, conflict. Um, so I'm curious to find out if maybe one of them it really is the killer or maybe really someone did a complete, you know, maybe a stranger or somebody did kill her and throw her in the trunk of the car trying to frame them. Is it somebody they know? Uh, what's the deal? So this is a very intriguing mystery to me. And I'm curious to find out if they really do try to hunt down the killer. He says he wants to find the killer, and the other person says, no, you don't. I wonder why. What's happened in the story uh, leading up to that point that made the other character he's talking to have that observation? So I wonder when this is coming out. Let's see. Trailer and movie soon. I mean, I mean, sorry, godly. Movie in theater soon. Um, but yeah, I'm guessing it'll probably be uh, available digitally, streaming somewhere probably fairly soon. This trailer was pretty short. It was just under a minute and 28 seconds, a little bit less than that. And I thought it was very well done. It didn't feel like it lagged anywhere, and it didn't feel like I didn't have the sense that it was feeling long. It wasn't long. There have been some movies that have been pretty short, but they felt like they were longer, and I think sometimes, I mean trailers, did I say movies? I think I may have said movies. Anyway, it felt like they were longer, probably because just the way it was constructed, that it felt like there was so much they were packing in there that it felt long not necessarily long in a bad way but it just felt like it was longer than it actually was this one moved along at a very steady clip so it, 
I didn't get the scent. It didn't feel too short and it didn't feel too long. It felt just right. I'm like, you know, Goldilocks. Not really. But um, anyway, I, th I thought it was well done. And I've got this now on record that I have expressed interest in watching this. And so when I watch it, I'll come back. A lot of these trailers, they look so good. And then sometimes I go researching them and they have abysmal ratings, which is a disappointment. And so maybe I'm just going to make it a habit not to look at any of the ratings before I watch it. Some of these, but sometimes you can't help it when you do a search to try to find where can you locate this particular movie. One of the very first things that comes up is a little snippet with the IMDb and Rotten Tomato score. So it's kind of hard to, it's kind of hard to avoid. But anyway, whenever I do get around to this, I will come back and give you guys my thoughts. And if any of you guys happen to see it, share your thoughts too, so we can talk about whether or not this was uh, well written or whether it sucked. Okay, that's it, you guys. Bye.